Hello everyone and thank you so much for stopping by. So for today's video, I'm going to be playing with the new Milani Soft and Sultry Eyeshadow Palette. And this is what the box looks like on the outside. And this eyeshadow palette is described as a cool neutrals and smoked out metallics eyeshadow and it's designed with a seductive mix of blendable shadows to be worn alone or together this palette features 12 pure pigment velvety mattes paired with intense shimmery metallics for a multitude of one of a kind eye looks and this one I found it at a Walmart near me I found it for $15 but I believe if you buy it on like uh, milani.com they're $20 so go check out your Walmart before you buy them online and you might find them I didn't see the other one the what is it called the the orange one that they came out with too along with this one I didn't see that one in store so I'm not sure um, if they're only bringing one of them but it comes with a pretty good sized mirror right here and I don't have anything that looks like these eyeshadows so I was pretty excited to add this when I first saw that they came out with this I'm not gonna lie I was pretty disappointed because when I heard that the one's called passion I thought it was gonna be like bright colors. also what I did notice when I was looking at this eyeshadow palette is that on the back it kind of gives you like an idea of of how you could wear these shadows so it says like you can wear these uh, the, uh, so it says that you can wear these four shades for like weekdays, these four shades for weekend, and these four shades for like fun days. So I thought that was pretty cool for people that aren't very familiar with eyeshadows that don't know exactly how to pair colors. It kind of gives you an idea and that's how they're set up on the inside to create different looks. But for today's video, I'm just going to be going back and forth between the colors and see what I can create with it. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get started and... I uh, already got my brows done. I did them with my Wet n Wild uh, Retractable Brow Pencil and I have mine in Ash Brown. So I did my brows already with this one. So I'm going to go ahead and prime the eyes now and I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Concealer in Light Medium Beige. So I'm going to go ahead and pat it out. I'm going to jump into the palette and I'm going to start this shade right here which is like the closest one to my skin color. So I'm going to put this all over the lid and just to set down the concealer. And I want to make sure that there are no creasing anywhere. So I'm going to take this shade right here, which is Tantation, and start adding that to the crease. I feel like you guys can't see what I'm doing. I'm going to zoom you in a little bit. Okay, then up next, I'm gonna take Smoking Hot, which is the shade right here, and then start adding that to the crease, but a bit lower than when I where I put the previous shade. Okay, and then up next, I'm gonna take this shade right here, which is Come Ither, Come Hither, Come Committer, Come Ither. I don't know. Look how pretty that is. Oh, so, so I'm gonna put that on the lid. <sighs> so pretty. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and deepen out my, um, 
my outer corner yes my outer corner and I'm gonna use this shade right here which is after hours I'm just gonna slowly start adding that to the outside And I'm gonna grab the fluffy brush from earlier and then just kind of blend everything out. Okay, and then with the pencil brush, I'm gonna go into Untamed, which is this shade right here. It's a really dark um, brown. I don't want to use the black, but I do want to use a very dark brown, and I'm just gonna create a liner. I've been really enjoying doing this when I just don't want to do my eyeliner, just getting the dark shade in the palette. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and clean up under the eye and do the rest of my makeup and now I'll come back to finish off the eyes. Okay, so I've already finished my face and I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my eyes and I'm gonna use the Milani Stay Put um, Waterproof Eyeliner in Stay With Slate and I'm just gonna put that on the lower lash line. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and jump into Temptation, which is this shade right here, and then start adding that to the lash line. Okay, then I'm gonna go into Smoking Hot, and then just add that to the outer half of the lash line. And then on a smaller brush, I'm gonna take um, After Hours with just this um, lighter, darker brown. And then just blending everything out. And then I'm gonna do my um, lashes, my bottom lashes with my Rimmel Lash Accelerator. Alright guys, and this is the finished look. I decided to pair it with um, the ColourPop Lippy Pencil in BFF2. And I topped it with the NYX Intense Butter Gloss in Cookie Butter. So these are the two that I put on my lip. Okay, so back to the eyeshadow. I feel like the this eyeshadow is a perfect everyday type of shadow. I feel like this is great for like work makeup or back to school. I feel like you can get really, really great simple looks with this uh, palette and I really like all these shades I mean I didn't have to dip into any other palettes I created this look I really 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 like the look that I created on my eyes I feel like it's so pretty so I feel like I'll reach for this a lot on days that I don't want to wear a lot of makeup or I want to do like a simple look but at the same time you get all these dark shades on the bottom and you get some shimmer so you can make them you know a little funner with the shimmers and you can make them like a night look or like an eyeliner like I did with the dark shade so I feel like it's a really complete palette so if you already were thinking about getting any of these I would definitely recommend this one especially if you're more into like cool tones or you just like simple makeup I was thinking of making like a day to night video with this palette I feel like it'd be a perfect palette to do so so let me know if that's something that you guys would be interested in watching but other than that, that is it for today's video. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Also, if you haven't subscribed already, I would appreciate if you would do so. And thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day or night, wherever it is that you are. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.